So what's going to be for Blaze, eh, Claire? AI or live cover? AI, unless she wants to trample. Does the vet and all the gear come as part of the deal? I didn't know it could all be so complicated. <laughs> we have such sophisticated conversation. <laughs> well, why don't we just let nature take its course? Because the stallion can get a bit carried away. Typical. They're valuable creatures, Tess. They have to be protected. Glad I'm not a thoroughbred. No, indeed. <laughs> we can bring wildfire over tomorrow if you like. Greg will have to sedate him, though. Do you have to? I'll just get hurt otherwise. Then leave him here. Have you had a go, Nick? Maybe you'll have better luck than Alex. I don't ride anymore. Oh. Is that because of what happened to your leg? Was it a riding accident? Yeah. Uh, would you like some more potatoes? No, thanks. Bet you miss it. We don't talk about this. Don't. Everyone knows. Yeah, well, I'm not everyone. Social customs aren't like osmosis, Claire. You can't just suck them up through your skin. <laughs> so what else aren't I allowed to mention? Fred Baring shooting himself. That's important. His daughter thinks it was an accident. So what did happen to Nick's leg? It was ages ago. <sighs> the boys went away. Alex came back. Nick was in hospital. That's all I know. Well, you never asked? Of course I did. Well, so what'd they say? It's a riding accident. Yeah, but didn't you ask what happened? How? Why? You saw Liz tonight. Would you have kept on asking? A walking stick. He was a spark. I reckon some scars are pretty sexy sometimes. Yep. <laughs> you guys are seriously weird, do you know that? Compared to Alex, Nick is creepy. Who cares what happened to his leg? It's their business, all right? That's why you don't talk about it. Oh, not to their face, behind their backs, just fine. <coughs> are you okay, Vic? Yeah, I'm fine. Sounds like you're coming down with something. We've got a calf with red water. What's that? Blood in the urine. Oh, that's got to be bad, yeah? I'll get Greg to take a look at it when he brings over wildfire. Oh, great. Bill's never going to stay away now. We won't tell him. Not till we know exactly what it is. So, Meg, there's got to be someone who knows the real story about Nick. Whatever it was, it almost killed Liz. There's a few things I there need. There are too much to do here. But surely that can be handled by the no, boys. Look, Liz, it's too late. We're already wasting half the morning taking this horse to drovers for this idiotic bet. There's no way Claire can break in wildfire. Well, neither could you. Nick, I'm going to need you to cover for Alex while he's off with the horse. I was going to go on. Yep. Sure. Blame your brother.
Everything's under control, so why, why don't we make a week of it? I would really like this, Harry. Sorry, love. Come. Yes, hello, Kalani. Uh, it's Ted Silverman, Mrs. Ryan. About last night, I'm truly sorry. I didn't mean to offend anyone. No, there's I... absolutely no need to worry. Thank you very much for calling. Greg wants us to keep an eye on him until the sedative wears off. But I reckon he should be fine. Pity we're at the sedative at all. Yeah, well, he could have broken him in at our place. <laughs> you breathing down my neck all the time? I don't think so. You're right. Take a good look, Blaze. Two grand for a roll in the hay with him. Let's get your money's worth when the time comes, OK? Are you coming? Greg's waiting. Uh, yep. In a sec. <laughs> so how's lover boy? I think Blaze is interested. She gave him a horsey sort of a look. Alex, about last night, I... Forget it. Please, let me apologise. I, I, I said forget say... it. All right? Well, I can't. I obviously asked a really insensitive question, and I've upset everyone, so I just... Tess, would you shut up? Just shut the hell up! No one says sorry in the country either. Be quicker if you told me what I can say. Hello, goodbye. How about a cuppa? So maybe it's uh, a phosphate or a weed they ate? No, there's too many of them, Claire. I'd say it's left, though. Damn. What's left, though? Bacterial infection. Contagious. And a notifiable disease. Uh-oh. My advice is you vaccinate the lot. Suggesting is supposed to be making us money, not costing us. 